Hello everyone, it is Lucy. I hope you're all having a jolly week. I know I am. I'm on the road to recovering from contact dermatitis, which is honestly a swell time. But today we're gonna be doing something a little, a little different. We're gonna shake it up Zendaya Bella Fawn style. Today we're gonna be doing a boyfriend does my ASOS haul. So this video is primarily inspired by a couple of comments I got on a recent video where I think I mentioned in passing that Max has really good style, which he does, really gives you the Ryan Gosling, indie Byronic hero kind of fantasy, which I love and I deserve and I receive. Um, <laughs> the comment said you should get your boyfriend to style you and I asked Max if he wanted to do it and he said okay, so that's what we're doing. Uh, we've been dating for a really long time, <laughs> almost seven years. Um, we love traveling together, we live together, we've been living together for a year now. But for any of you who've been around for a little while, you probably will have seen Max in some of my really old travel vlogs. Uh, so you can head over to my vlog channel that's been going for quite a while. Um, we have been to Japan together and he's in those videos. That's him and he's gonna join me now and I'm gonna figure out this camera situation because it's a very narrow office. It's perfectly sized for a single Lucy, so wish me luck. Cheers, Gromit. Alrighty, I'm here with BF. Hello, BF. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> Welcome to the Lucy.Livin uh, metaverse. Now yeah, I'm in the Livin Lucy metaverse, to be honest. <laughs> Yes, yeah, I'm on the Instagram stories. Yeah, semi regularly, not I'm... tagged, but I'm there in the video. <laughs> not tagged. Yeah. Well, you know, you like you're a private person. I have recently gone back to private Instagram. Yeah, mm. my all of 200 some followers uh, have the privilege of seeing my exclusive content. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just not very active on social media these days, sadly. Sadly for, for me, I suppose. Oh, for okay. all my fans, yeah, for, my, <laughs> for the audience. Like, it would reveal my actual name, so yeah. I don't think it's No, true. Thing. Let's not dox ourselves no. today. Not today. Maybe next time. Our dress is <laughs> I just want to know if you can do Editing. the if you can do the beep edits. Oh, I can, test. I can do the beep okay. edits. Yeah. That was me imitating the beep. <laughs> <laughs> like so Snow the beep. The beep is when you have a beep it's just like beep. But in terms of the format, just so you're all across how this kind of went down, mm -hmm. basically the idea that I posed was that you pick three outfits across a couple of different themes. Casual, date night, wild card. Wild card. See it into oh. my memory because <laughs> it is a traumatic experience. A trauma! But we'll get to it. We'll get to that. <laughs> So I, I gave you that and I gave you my card and I said, you know, it's okay. You can you can just go crazy. If there's anything we don't love, you know, we can return. That's the beauty of ASOS. Um, I gave you an extensive guide to my sizing <laughs> and how to choose sizes. And then you ordered. How was that experience? Well, I haven't actually watched a video where uh, a boyfriend picks their girlfriend's outfit. Yeah. Because uh, I don't watch much YouTube. No. Um, and so I thought it would be... Can we just talk about the two YouTube channels you do watch? Yeah, I watch James <laughs> Hoffman, who King. is a coffee YouTuber. I love him. And basically, I think the only good YouTube channel, really. You know what? Um, <laughs> That's fair. And then there's one more, which has been a more recent <laughs> Yeah, edition. I watch the account Yeetle, who I think is primarily a Twitch Yeetle. streamer. Oh, yeah. okay. Wow. But they also do uh, the VODs of their Twitch streams, and it's just... A guy who plays the Overwatch character Hammond, who is a, like a rat in a mech suit. He just plays his one character. Hamster or ball. Everyone calls it ball. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, it's, it's, shape. it's like a it's a just wrecking a ball, <laughs> but like the rat drives it. I would say you're a, a gourmet YouTube watcher. You only watch a few things, but the few things you watch are distinguished. I guess. <laughs> I would just more the say, ball I would rolling more around. Say, yeah. So you went shopping on ASOS, and how'd you go with the kind of like theme format? So I found it quite difficult, just given that when I actually thought about buying clothes, it was for my wardrobe, mm. uh, and then when I actually thought about your uh, sense of style and how you dress, yeah, it doesn't have a lot of parallels. And it's hard for me to know what's good in that realm because I don't wear any of it myself, and then also to know what you would look good in. Because, yeah, I guess we don't have, we don't have the same body type. No, no. So the, BBL win. Because originally <laughs> I was like, oh, I'll just buy you a bunch of clothes that I would wear. Um, right. Um, you found casual easy, and I remember you saying that you. I, I mean, no, no, I do not find it easy. Oh, okay. Um, Sorry. <laughs> I just found it 
doable comparatively to the date night stuff. See, a lot of our dates that we go on are like, we go on like daytime dates. We live in Brisbane. We live in Brisbane. <laughs> I remember after you shopped, I was like, oh, how'd you go? And then you, I remember you being like, what even is women's formal wear? Well, yeah, what is date it seems night? like you're paying like quite a bit of money for like a piece of fabric with some slits in it. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Like, Sorry, I just visualized a top is just like boob hole. It's just like, I don't know yeah, how yeah, you meant yeah, to know yeah. unless you've worn stuff from a similar brand or in that style, like what looks good. And so that's correct. I was at a crossroads here where I was like, I could buy a heap of stuff or what I've done here and why I think you thought the order was small is I was like, I'm going to pick <laughs> things that I'm pretty confident in. Yeah. Can I just show you the size of the bag? So this is for three outfits. I did preface it with that you could use basics from your wardrobe. Yeah. Because no, I didn't think I there was much point in buying well, another white tee. We kind of like thought, yeah, no, that's true. I definitely have enough white crop tops. I was just giving you free reign. And then I wasn't, I didn't check my emails to see the order or anything like that. I want to be as I still don't know what's in here, but I did check my bank account because I'm a responsible, financially intelligent woman. And then I saw it was only, it was like a hundred dollars. <laughs> when I saw that it was a hundred dollars and then when it actually arrived and it's, you know, this big. Um, so I'm really keen to see. I have to be real. I can't really remember <laughs> which of the items that um, I shortlisted that we actually Yeah. Did. So what were the three themes that you kind of ended up doing then? If we not... did two casual and two a casual. wild card. Wild so card. really, to be honest, kind of three <laughs> casual. I think this is casual number one. Okay. Ooh. What do you think it is? I think it's a skirt think or it's a skirt? dungaree. Yeah, you're right on the second point there. <gasps> They're mm. a size 10 and it's the ASOS design brand. Twirl dungarees with pockets. Cute. And pale pink. This is a nice pink too. So this fit on this I'm unsure of like anything on mm. ASOS. They didn't have a lot of variation in uh, the like on item models. Yeah. So it's hard to guess. But in the reviews of this one, uh, I got a sort of sense that it would be flattering the based color. on the reviews. Oh, they're, oh, they're like full dungarees. Okay, well, <laughs> let's see how we go. All right, so you want me to wear this with the white crop top? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go put these on and uh, I'll be back. I think the size is right. Yeah, I don't think I don't think going any bigger would be better. I don't think any small would be better. That seems fine. Oh, have you looked at yourself in the full-length mirror? Yes. I'm gonna go do that. What do you think of the? What do I think? Um, <laughs> can you do a spin? Um, I think they're quite good but I don't think you'll like them. That's pretty accurate. I think they're, I think they're good. I think the quality of them is actually quite decent, mm -hmm. quite nice. And I assume they would be less than $50 considering that the whole, I'll put the item up on the screen there because I don't know how much they were, but I'll be able to check the details after. Yeah. Um, alien. <laughs> Why don't you like them? Um, I think the fit, it's, quite like loose and baggy um, with a cinch in the middle, which is what I like, mm -hmm. but then it's really tight on my thighs. Okay. Um, I would prefer maybe a straighter cut on the leg that kind of skims all the way down. I thought you would be more anti how like elongated the torso section is. Cause I do. What was that? What was that? Okay, James. Yeah, that was good. Um, so I think, I think they're not bad at all. I, can I just say what I thought when I put this on? Mm -hmm. I thought you looked like a Teletubby. <laughs> I also thought that I looked like a Teletubby. I've <laughs> got our buddies right there. You want to bring the, bring the crew out? That one specifically. It was kind of like that. Same energy. Let the audience decide. <laughs> I think it's cute enough. It's cute. I mean, it fits. Yeah, it fits. So, point yeah. one, that's really the goal. <laughs> Done. It's I better it's... than I expected. Yeah. So I'm glad, and I kind of went with it first because it's like the most confident. Um, this is you're most confident in this. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the kind of thing where I think unless you tried it on, you wouldn't you wouldn't know entirely. But I think it's a it's a solid pick. I totally see why you picked it. Just not totally right for me. All right. But it's good. Next. These two I think are bordering on like you could wear this to an office. I wouldn't wear them in the evening if you get what I'm saying. Okay. So they're like not fun. 
Um, <laughs> no, they're just like not. I would say they're not formal. Another pinafore. Another. Pinafore. Yeah. Yeah. This is a pinafore. Is it? It's a dungaree pin. Like, is, that what the a same... pin is that what a pinafore is? Do you just like? Okay, cool. This Other... is. Is it ASOS of... brand or is it a different? Is natural ASOS brand? design. Okay. Yeah. Gift. So, oh. <laughs> I could wear this to an office. You think? I get the vibe. It's um, it's giving me schoolgirl. <laughs> I think it's preppy. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. Think school girl. I've worn stuff like this. This yeah. one, I was kind of like, you could do polo if you want to be extra preppy, but I couldn't really find a polo I liked on ASOS. Okay, so. I have a white polo. It's kind of cropped. I was thinking mostly. that. Yeah. Okay. It's just like the length, Gryffindor. the length and the crop. I was like, it's a, it's a, um, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know how much skin you want to show. Ooh. <laughs> What's the? What? I could not wear this to an office. I could not wear. If you wore tights, on. isn't that? Oh, uh, okay. In winter, yeah, I could wear that. Yeah, like what? Oh, like I've just had some office experiences. It's not. This is kind of like what I used to wear when we like started dating. I wore more kind of vintage, kind of stuff. Retro. You have no recollections. No, not really. Okay. <laughs> Alright, shall I go pop this on? Yeah. Ready, I'll come back. Gonna do a little book report. Actually, I can do a little candle report. We have uh, Vanilla Bean Noel, which is a candle uh, left over from last Christmas, which Lucy's still burning, uh, which is good. Actually, last Christmas or the one before? How old's the candle? It's last Christmas. Okay, so it's good because we're almost around to Christmas where we'll get a whole new set of uh, Christmas candles to I'm use next year. Sale is coming. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, what we want? Okay. Um, so what's wrong with the straps? Wait. You've got them twisted, question mark? No. no? Okay. They just haven't fumbled. Oh, they, they look alright at the back? Uh, yes. They have, a, you can tighten them. Oh, okay. You need to do the straps tighter. Okay. They're dangling well, all over the shop. <laughs> so you're telling me I had a Halloween costume the whole time? What would you be? Sexy schoolgirl. <laughs> Gryffindor! I don't know why you think it's Gryffindor. It's like red and yellow. But don't they wear clothes? No, but- Actually, after like the third movie, they just switch to just wearing <laughs> casual clothes yeah. in all scenes. <laughs> they don't wear the uniforms at all. It's just and one of many continuity errors with the uh, Harry Potter franchise. <laughs> now what do you think? Um... What was your vision? What was my vision? I mean, it doesn't help you're not wearing shoes. Okay. I can tell you don't like it, so I'm I... hesitant to go too strongly in that direction. But on the whole, I don't think this is terrible. I agree. In fact, I would say the white polo as envisioned, yeah, like I think this could work. My issue more so is just with the quality of the ASOS version of this. It's quite um thin. It's yeah. quite like flimsy. I think if I wore this with a turtleneck in winter, in tights. I had a lot of stuff. Yeah, I had stuff like that, but it is our spring, almost summer. Yeah, so it's hot. I took most of that out of the cart because I just thought it was pretty um, ridiculous. It's, and obviously, you know, I wear pleated skirts, so it's not out of style for me. Um, these are not really colours I think I would ever wear. Well, I think it matches now because I'm blonde. And so it kind of, you know, works at the moment. But I think because I'm going to dye my hair again soon, and I dye my hair quite often, I don't think it'll look good with colours, maybe. I think of the Venn diagram of our style, both of us have kind of a preppy element to our style, would you Would you say? The stuff that I bought today is stuff that I would wear if I were you. Sorry, maybe more stuff that I would wear if I was a woman. Okay. In that it has a lot of the, the strap elements to both. Uh, in my fashion I love a lot of utility, so mm. I like the straps here. Okay. And I think you'll see in the third piece there's also an, an emphasis on uh, <laughs> things you can play with. So you can do cool tricks. I don't really have a lot else to say because I think it's like fine. Can you give me a spin? It's quite short. But yeah, but it's not like questionably short, which is obviously the zone, the danger zone that I was near. I think it's a fine length. I just would have to, I couldn't bend over. That's the price of being hot. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. <laughs> kind of my optimal length is kind of around that length for a mini skirt, yeah. but that's also danger length. Is for this a mini skirt? This is a mini skirt. Maybe my mind's warped. I kind of thought this is just 
normal skirt these days. I would say it's a short skirt, because mini to me would be I, uh, yeah. And I don't think I look bad in this. It's just not, you know, my... I wouldn't pick it for myself, but I see why you picked it for you. For me. Good friend. <laughs> Um, I think this is the most formal piece. Okay. Ooh, I like the colour. Uh, I wanted to get some sort of polo dress. Ooh. They didn't have really much. And then I wanted to get like a shirt dress. And then I did a whole thing on ASOS where it was very difficult to find items in stock. Yeah. In a size. Yeah. Uh, and so it was not my first choice version of it, but it is quite similar to what I had. So okay. it is a... Uh, like a collared button Ooh. dress. New Look is a brand that I haven't ordered much from, but they have really cute. Like, I like the style of their. Okay. <gasps> Ooh! Wait, this could be. No. <laughs> Naughty. This is cute. I'm a little worried about the material because it feels cottony, but maybe it's like a cotton poplin, so like a stretch. Uh, it is poplin, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, here you go. This, okay, so far, this one, just from looking at it, we'll have to see how it looks on, but this is. Of the three, I would actually keep this like a hundred percent. If like in terms of my style, yeah, this I mean, is something I would wear. Okay. So I'm so really excited to try this on. Okay, let's go. Yeehaw. <laughs> oh, Gia. What? There's like a huge bug in uh, by the window. That's what's buzzing. Yeah, that's the bug. Where is it? Crawling on the windowsill. Oh, it's big! Yeah. Now, what are your thoughts on this? Rough again, because uh, it's... Not like, I'm really wrinkly. But I would say easily my least favourite of the Really? Picks. Yeah. I think it is uh, not flattering. It's very uh, shapeless. The cinch needs to be like more aggressive. It really doesn't help that it's so wrinkled. Uh, Do you want me to give it a... No, I don't think. Like, I don't like it even if you did, to be honest. Um, I think that the sleeve, it's, it's just like it's, it's just really... so conservative. As I was putting it on, I was kind of like, oh, no, because it's like close to being good. Like the concept, I totally get why you picked it, because mm. I also like this style. Yeah, but it's not executed very well, is it? And it's and giving it just me feels prairie. Very, yeah, it feels like, very like nun esque. Yeah. Um, it's like, oh no, she's got scarlet fever. Like I look like an orphan. It's just a very like vintage blue colour, which I also really like, but I just think the combo of the conservative elements. Like, if it was like less... It's not terrible. I don't think it's terrible at all. And it provides good UV protection. Is it positive? Yes. You know, probably good and for summer. And the cotton is quite light, mm -hmm. so it would be comfy. You can unbutton these and roll them. Oh, yeah. Do you okay. want to give that a try? No one's elbow is there. They'd have the world's longest arm. No, no, but is it meant to be, like, there? No, or, yeah. it's meant to be where it is. Yeah. I think it's just the style. Uh, yeah, it's very... Like, church girl, go to church and read your Bible. Like, okay, out of all three, this is the one where when I pulled it out, I thought this is the closest to my style. Mm. But I don't, yeah, I don't know if I'd wear this, unfortunately. Womp womp. The idea's good. In the bin. Uh, in the bin? Do people like this in their reviews? I can't recall. <laughs> I like the collar detail. It's kind of cute. It exists. The elements are it's good. It's above the bare minimum, yeah. It has all the flavours that I like. I like little covered fabric buttons like this. I love a good, you know, collar with a bit of lace. Like cotton, like puff sleeve, but it's just more like little town on the scary. Oh, it's a little house on the prairie, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> Alrighty, so in terms of how it all went, Mm -hmm. The three outfits, or should I say the three items? Because three items. <laughs> How would you rank your picks? I think that this one is definitely my least favorite. Yeah, I don't really it. have much nice to say about it. Yeah, the benefit of the doubt being that it's not ironed, and it is a garment that presumably would look better if it didn't have the creases it did. But even if that was <laughs> the case, I would encourage you never to wear this. Yeah, uh, it's giving call the midwife. Yeah, and then also just from like the construction standpoint, like it's already like the buttons already seem loose yeah. and parts, and like I can see loose threads hanging around. This, is, so. this, this sleeve is so weird to me. It's a no from me. Mm -hmm. And then I would say I probably like the pinafore the best. 
Okay. Like the three. Which one is that? The second <laughs> island. The sky. Yeah. The sky. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If you were to keep one of the items, I would keep that one. Yeah. Um, just given, I think that, yeah, you had some lingering concerns re how the dungarees fit, which would be mm. my second place. And what about you? What did you think of in terms I... of the I think my ranking is the same. I would oh, say... <laughs> really? I thought the dungarees were going to be number one. For me? Yeah. You seem to react more positively to them initially compared I... to the pinnacle, which you were like... I think, okay, I think it's just genuinely because I just don't... Like, I don't wear those colours. Mm. But I don't hate it. I don't hate it. I think it looks nice. The silhouette is nice. The fit is nice. Quality is not amazing. But, you know, give me a little bit of a ooh ah sensation. Look kind of cute. But then this one, the blue colour and stuff, all the details I really like. But yeah, it just looks... It's like just a nothing dress. I wouldn't wear it out. And then the pink dungarees, I would wear them. Um, but I wouldn't... I think I'd have them in my wardrobe, but it would be like I'd, I'd rarely wear them. Mm. I think it's just... The few elements of fit, I'd probably take it to a tailor to get it like perfect. Yeah, it's not which, getting tailored. No, I don't think it's worth getting tailored, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. The colour was pretty and I think it was more in line with kind of the, my vibe and style. I think you did a good job for shopping for you, for, for me, for you if you were me, or for you if you were a woman. You did a good job. Thank you. Oh. So yeah, guys, let us know in the comments <laughs> uh, which of the three you thought were the best. And uh, if you disagree with Lucy or I's ranking, which was actually the same <laughs> at the end, funnily enough. Mummy made you some content, yum yum, hope you enjoy. Well, I hope this uh, pleases those few commenters who wanted to see the boyfriend the boyfriend pick outfit content. Uh, quite uninspiring, being here personally. <laughs> I'm not sure that uh, I'd be one to request this again on the channel, but you know, if you do want to see it again, give it a cheeky like. Watch some of Lucy's other good videos, such as Princess Polly Try On. Yes. And Chu Fashion, K Fashion Hall. <laughs> SEO King. <laughs> Click the links, top and bottom. All the information and the link will be in the description below, as it is wont to do. Well, I hope you enjoyed the little uh, shake up in content on the channel. And as always, thank you so, so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Perfect. Hold on. As ever, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye!